And welcome everyone here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for some Karma Thresh Control, one of my favorite control decks in the format. Uh, also known as Spooky Karma, um, but Spooky Karma is kind of like the same deck but doesn't play Thresh, and I think that playing Thresh is the way to go with this deck. I think that uh, Thresh is just such a good card, and it's just worth it playing in um, this control deck. But yeah, this is one of the slowest decks in Legends of Runeterra. You're definitely trying to uh, out-control them and uh, be the last person standing. Um, yeah, let's just uh, let's go straight to the games. Not too much to say about the deck. It's not really changing very much. We ha How we've played this deck before, I've usually just played two Thresh. But Thresh is so good. We're getting the third Thresh in here. Like last time we played it, we played one The Box and two Thresh. And before we had a Will of Ionia and two Thresh, and um, we're just going to the third th Thresh instead of those cards. <clears throat> All right, so we got Iceborne Spiders. That's what this deck is that we're playing against. Let's keep Deny and keep one Thresh. I mean, the second Thresh being the box is actually kind of nice. I just don't really have any, you know, like, I like all these cards. I just don't have anything to do to, like, turn five, which is kind of the problem with keeping this hand. So maybe we just get rid of these two, just so we're not super slow. Never mind, two pair. They're like, you want to keep Deny and Thresh? Well, here you go. Here's Deny and Thresh. <laughs> and then we get our missed call back. Uh, so yeah, we're not doing anything till turn five, it looks like. Hopefully we're not dead by then. Hey, we drew something to do before turn five. I walk my path alone. Okay, my opponent is a very good player from Greece. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. attack so if I play deny or grasp the undying then I won't have we'll deny this now I won't be able to play Thresh and have the extra three mana for like a missed call but oh well we'll have eight mana Could have another Brood Awakening, and I don't have Deny for it right now. Deny could be really useful with like an Atrocity later. Ugh. Could be. Could have just got the monk in play, and then next turn played Thresh. But I want to get Thresh in play. And then start being able to play removal spells. So they got five cards in hand right now. Um, I think I just let it happen. Honestly, I think my best play is playing Karma with Deny back up right now. I think that's my best play. Do 
All right, well, we can just let this resolve because we have the box. So that's going to kill three units. So that's going to be four for Thresh. Blocking here will be five. I still do have Deny. Maybe I'll just do this and make it six. So hopefully this happens. We level up Thresh. We get to attack with leveled up Thresh. Put another Karma into play. Then even if like leveled up Thresh dies, Rekindler, bring it back. Sown Seeds is probably like the, the actual worst card to get, right? Like it probably is, right? At least when you're playing Ezreal, you know, it can count as two two mana, two burst speed spells, you know, when you have your leveled up karma and Ezreal. Um let's see. Might as well attack with the. Might as well attack with the other karma. Also, because since we're bringing one in. I'd rather just have like Thresh be guaranteed to die because I want to rekindle her and put another Thresh into play. Because then another Thresh puts another karma into play. But I wonder if I wonder if that's bad if we put another karma into play because then I don't have another karma in my deck where I get to, you know, use, like, the whole karma's insights and stuff. So whenever I level up, I'm just gonna use this mana right now and not, uh, not waste it. Whenever we enlighten and Karma levels up with enlightened, then Vengeance will kill Trindamir. As far as I know, that's a great card to draw. Will of Ionia. That is really good against Trindamir. Mist Call is pretty great. You know, we just got a, a free Karma and a free Thresh with the Mist Call. Mist Call is this one right here. Pretty awesome. I 
I haven't seen this deck with uh, Scuttle Guys before. That's different. It's kind of different too. I don't know how to want to do this. Definitely have to do something. Getting that card out of my hand. Because we're going to be getting two free spells right now. And we're only going to be able to bank three mana anyway. That atrocity? That is atrocity. Answer lies within. Is this like triple atrocity that just kills them? Or no, you have to kill your ally to, to do it. Yes, that doesn't work. Um, we burn, then kindle anew. So the Thresh will put another Karma into play, and we can just attack out and try to kill him. Right now, like if they just play one blocker, they die. Fifteen damage. They have to have two spells that stop me. Uh, we know they have. They, we know they have a they who endure. So they only have three cards. So out of those three cards, two of them have to be things that stop me, or you know, just something be burst speed. I guess that would work as well. Yeah, so one one Enlightened Karma and an unleveled Trindamir would do 17 damage. Um, let's do this. 
This is fun. This is fun. Alright, there we go. GG's. Back up to 20. Like we never left. Unlocked. <laughs> Define fun, because I would call it sick. Karma is pretty disgusting. Portrait to mirror. Extra copies. Get those shards 15. That should say 15 shards, not shards 15. Alright, so. Moral of the story you get shards. Alright, new region. Piltover and Zon. We only got two regions left. Finish up PNZ. Get those chests. Uh, Karma Thresh. Yeah, Karma is... Karma's really good. They, they made the control champions... It seems like they made the control champions better than the other champions, but I mean, I guess if you think about like Zed, Lucian, like how are you, like, you're not going to make a better two mana champion than Lucian, right? Like that same thing, three mana Zed, but these control ones, just because they can stay out longer and just affect the game longer, they are pretty crazy. All right, this looks like Karina control. Um, we're going to get rid of these two cards, keep the monk call combo. Looks like Karina Control. Elise would have been a problem if they had Elise on turn two. I don't really have a good answer for Elise, so I'm glad they don't. And besides just blocking Elise with Solitary Monk, I suppose. We don't need to play Awakener till later. I basically mulligan and Awakener all the time. She's back. Any random ally that died this round. Alright, looks like we got the 4-3. Could have been any. It was random. Lady Elise, please take me home. Hush, my sweet. It'll be over soon. I need no weapon. Unfortunately, double miss call doesn't make a lot of sense. Because then the other one would, would you know, you just pick it back up. Man, yeah, we are so lucky. We just got the best option again. So lucky. Solitary Monk. Alright, fine. Solitary Monk's finally dead. Oh, you got me.
Oh, I don't have deny mana for karma now. Do I still risk playing karma without deny mana? Probably not. I mean, I could I could probably just play Awakener. Maybe I should have just played the Awakener. No, I shouldn't play the Awakener either. We'll bring peace to Ionia, whatever the cost. Thanks for staying up late, Alexa. There's nothing to fear. Oh, I thought that was a missed call. Hmm. I don't know if I'm supposed to splinter soul the karma. I mean... It would be great to Splinter Soul the Karma, because then we get an extra, a free spell. But if they have like a removal for Karma, that would be bad. They didn't have removal for Karma the last turn. All right, I don't think they'll have removal for Karma now. Sure. Hmm. Am I supposed to wait till next turn? No, because they're gonna go straight to attacks. I just do this now. Basically, just turning the Splinter Soul into a different free card. That's all I'm doing. Oh, sorry, it's Alex. My bad. No. No. We need to find a rekindler. Now I am cool head, steady hand, unwavering heart. Oh man! Why couldn't I have that death mark a little earlier? No. My wisdom is no Hey, that's a good card. I recognize that one. So I think still a 9-4 over there. The 9 part's pretty big. The 9 part's pretty big. Don't have a great option to fight through this. Wheel. That's bad. Wait, 
Where are you? Sledros is going to be a problem. Already is a problem. Will already be a problem. Everything's a problem. <laughs> Night falls. I guess we're supposed to cast this withering will during combat. Definitely really thought about playing a Ledros ourself and you know playing two Thresh, one Ledros. This is definitely like the Ledros matchup. Just Deathmark did something. Crash is only at three. The w to level up Thrush, I have to go down to one. No, I, I don't even level up Thrush. Do I even have a Karma left for my deck to pull? Maybe I don't even have a Karma left in my deck to pull. Commander Ledros. GG's. No, with me with me taking that line of going down to one, I'm forcing myself to have to deny the Commander Ledros trigger to stay alive.
not good. Darn. That's why you need Ledros, is for, for this kind of mirror match where we're both playing the Shadow Isles late control game. Um, the person with the Ledros is going to beat the person without the Ledros. It's, that's the reason to play one. I... I couldn't think of any card that I want to take out um, over, you know, just playing like two Thresh and one Ledros. That really kind of seems like the only place to, uh, the only place to find room for one. Um, other suggestions in chat were taking out the health potion, but I think that's an important card to have, especially with like all these Ezreal decks running around. An important thing to have burst speed with Karma's. Um, and grass, and I like grass of the undying also, same kind of thing. I, I think that that's an, an important interaction tool. That's killing this kind of stuff. Oh wait, I thought this was Draven Ez. What is this? Draven? Oh, it's Draven Katarina. Draven Cat. I thought this was Draven it, Draven Ez. You know, whenever I just saw the champions originally, saw the Draven and. Kind of assumed from there. Could go two skitterer. Could go that that route. Could take out a skitterer. I, I could see doing that. Yeah, I could I could see going two skitterer. Yeah. Yeah, two. Yeah, I agree. Two skitties is probably fine. I was planning on playing my other Solitary Monk and picking this one back up until they played the Draven. That was my plan. Victory requires a sharp blade. Well, that's a good skitty. Obviously, they have they have the spinning axe. Um, no, it's not worth it. Sure. Basically, the question is, do I save my mana and do I Ruination the next turn? But it's just a Draven and two little spiders. I think the answer is no. I did have karma. I did have karma deny turn. Plus three, plus zero, and overwhelm. I'm kind of waiting to ruination first. Oh, careful of their deny. Yeah, I mean they could have deny. That'd be bad. Cool. 
playing our two things out. They played two more things out. That works great. This battering ram is quite big. Kato doesn't even have overwhelm himself. They should give this card overwhelm. It, this card is an epic. This should this should at least be a five mana five three overwhelm. Not a big deal that one died. You know, we got a, we got a backup, uh, and then now we have you know rekindler can bring one back. Ugh, gotta find my wisdom is now my strength. Something to deal with, with these things. Strength and conviction. We had six random spells. It does fill up our hand. Dang. Um, so yeah, we're just not going to be able to draw next turn. This... Uh, that can be awesome with Rekindler. can also be awesome with Awakener, I suppose. Yeah, we're just not going to get a card next turn. Which is fine. Our hand is pretty good. Withering Whale. I give you muscles. The muscles. Muscles. Enlightenment. Such naivete. I don't have I don't have room for this. You know, like we would put three copies into our hand. I don't I don't have room in my hand. So like we have the miss call, so we can uh, revive one of these two. Whichever one dies, you know, a random one that dies. Well, they're they're obviously both dying, but well, I guess the six six isn't dying right now. Everything's burst speed. All right, well, if they're going all in on these. Hey, yeah, Karma Thrash is going good, Josh. Welcome. <clears throat> Karma is super powerful. But see the downside of having a bunch of pump spells. Right there, we had we had enough life gain and everything to survive. 
All right, we're two and one. We lost the Shadow Isles control mirror against Ledros. But as long as they don't have Ledros, we're looking good. Elise Darius. Wonder if I should mulligan Thresh and stuff too and look for like Withering Whale mm. and other cards like that. I have my orders. Yeah, probably should have mulliganed the Thresh also. Just kept the Skitter and looked for Withering Whale and File Feast. That kind of stuff. We have instead drawn a Rekindler and two other five mana champions, so these are definitely the games we can lose. We can lose to aggro if we don't have a good hand. And it looks like their hand's good. Yeah. There are basically six dead cards. <laughs> All right. Definitely should have mulliganed this Thresh, but I don't think it was going to make a difference. How poorly we've drawn. All right, two and two, and let's get this last one. Yep, that's, yeah, that's aggro. They'll, they'll run you over if you don't stop them, and we didn't stop them. Yeah, Solitary Monk is a three mana, four, three elusive, just a huge body on an elusive creature for only three mana. It's a very good deal. You, of course, have to pick up your other creatures, which... If it's your only creature playing, not a downside. Uh, we can pick up Rekindle, like in the super late game, we can use it to pick up Rekindler to replay Rekindler. And get some work in with that. Um, Why is it that whenever I keep my five mana champion, we immediately draw another one? Ugh. Uh, yeah, the, the spider karma is also really good. Yeah, I think that, that deck's also quite good. That Spider Karma is better against... Um, it's better against aggro than the deck that we're playing. But I think that our version is better against control and like better against like the Spider Karma. Like I think that the Spider Karma isn't as good against other Shadow Isles decks that are playing Withering Whale. You're just turning on their Withering Whales and, and everything. And there's so much life gain that... So... I think the, the spider karma is really good against aggro decks, though. It's it's great against aggro. Aggro, yeah, it really, really struggles against that kind of deck. Um, but... Uh, yeah, I'll go with this. <clears throat> um, but I think it's worse against the other Shadow Isles decks. I will play my part. Defend our 
So we have Vile Offering, or Vile Feast, let's say that that card's Vile Offering, a Vile Feast to, um, you cannot escape. to start draining this thing. You think my opponent has a Deny in hand? I do have a denying hand. I had two denies in hand. That's all right. Get those denies out before, you know, like whenever we find ruination. Don't let them have, you know, they won't have denies again. Get those things out. Um, I think I want to play the Karma before every Kindler. Question mark. Or do I just want it to rekindle her? Basically, I can have like multiple karmas in play. If I go karma, then rekindle their karma. Um, we each no, we probably rekindle our karma. Oh, because the bannerman whiffed. So you're saying that is denied because the bannerman whiffed. Um, I mean they they play other things like you know here's a shen like they could have had another shen in, in hand I guess. That's possible. No. Down. Down. Get down. Speaking of Shen, we got Shen's Stand United. No one goes hungry. Such naivete. That's not a bad spell to be playing right now. Counter and strike. Am I muted? There we go. Am I muted? Okay. Back. That was a Fiora's repost. So I shuffled a Fiora back in. Through a lot of cards to kill this this karma of mine. We'll bring back a random ally that that died this round, though. It could be any ally. Uh, we're not necessarily saying which one. Oh, hey, it was karma. That was good. That was like our best hit. That was a really good random hit that we just had. Very good. Super random. One candle for every soul. Okay. Take those. Definitely like this Withering Whale against the Barrier deck. Strike quickly, strike deftly. All down. 
It is not yet there. Our wills align. All right, let's see. So we're going to definitely cast Withering Whale. Guess that's step number one. And then we'll barrier life steal one of my things. Um, and it doesn't really matter which one, I suppose. And we'll just get this one one out of the way. You can just get out of here, basically. I need more more spots for more creatures. Oh, what does Rekindler say? I don't hear the quotes super well because I have like the music is really really quiet. Your move. Why would? Why are they playing that? Just to. Just to kill my Rekindler? The King They're pretty dead, I'd have to say. They look like they're pretty dead. The Order rewards its faithful. Okay, yeah, I had no idea what he says in particular, but it sounds really cool. We then kindle anew. Like, is that like rebirth? The eye of twilight. Kindle anew. Not yet there. Oh, I guess with, with both karmas dying, I was thinking I was going to get three new karmas, but with both karmas dying, I'm not getting three new karmas, am I? Alright, let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Um, I'm just going to burn off the card I draw. I think that's okay. Man, yeah, this is like super greedy. I want to play Solitary Monk and put all three of these back in my hand because they're so great to keep replaying. Well, that's super greedy, right? I mean, we're at 20. We have like Emerald Awakener. Probably super greedy. Alone, see things as they truly are. Hopefully it's not a good card here. Yeah, there we go. That was not a good card. It must be done. We'll take it. Ally! You will be scoured from this land! If I must. Well, maybe I just killed myself. Oh, come on. I really did just kill myself. Man, I was trying to do, like, the cutest play we possibly could. Uh, this is... A this is what you get for trying to have fun on stream. My play was super cute. Very punished. I should have just missed called, got my karma, you know, had blockers. 
back to back repost for lethal you know for barely lethal that's that's their two cards and their burst speed i'm sitting with three denies oh trying to have some fun at the end of the night you know trying to have some fun i was trying to get all that rekindler value pup but i guess they had 12 pump with their one card in hand and then the card they drew they had 12 pump with that oh well, that's teaches me yep, mission failed <laughs> yeah we'll get him next time uh yes yeah, so like a ledros it does seem like that we could use one ledros um and i think i think probably taking out a skitter makes sense uh, as far as like what to take out i could see taking out an awakener also i could see taking out one of those two um or you know maybe we do take out the solitary monk maybe solitary monk's just like something you have as a one of um it's a great turn three play i always like seeing this on turn three but it's not something you necessarily need to draw later on um but yeah it would it would be nice because the shadow owl control decks are popular it'd be nice to have one ledros um I like the health potion. I think the health potion can help you stay alive. Especially with like all the burn spells and people playing Ezreal's with, with all the burn. With Ezreal. It's honestly probably Awakener. Because it's like Awakener is not, not very impactful on turn 3. It's not till like the late game, and if you get to like the late game, you're probably winning. Um, do we beat Ezreal with this deck? Uh, yeah, I know Awakener is OP late, but do you need three of them though? Can you just have two if they're OP late? Like we already have like OP late stuff, don't we? Like with Karma. And everything. Like rekindle their back karma. So maybe it is Skitter. I don't know. See that's the thing, it's I don't I don't know which one of these to take out. For a Ledros. Maybe you just don't go with the Ledros. Maybe you just hope to Maybe you just hope Karma can can win the game for you against those other Ledros decks. Maybe you just don't even go Ledros. Yeah, that's how I kind of just that's how we just kind of ended up before uh, playing the games. Also, was yeah, you know, I just don't really want to take out any of these cards. If you can have, you know, multiple karmas going, you know, with Karma Rekindler, you can hopefully win the late game. Anyway, but. Um, yeah, that's true. Wakeners is also early life steal. Skitter is so good against, or er, playing early defense though also. Uh, I guess it could be the twin disciplines, but I feel like that does a good job of protecting stuff, like protecting karma. Maybe it's the Vengeance. Maybe you just don't play Vengeance. Did we ever, like, really use Vengeance? I mean, we, we had it that we could have killed, like, a... Uh, whatever the name of that 8-4... Trindamir, but... No, three... Yeah, three Rekindlers is awesome. Like, that's... It's... Because, like, the Karmas die. Like, it lets you play Karma and Thresh and let them die and then bring them back. Um, honestly, maybe it is just Vengeance. Maybe that's the card to cut. For Ledros. I don't know. Yeah, I think you can get rid of Vengeance. It's seven mana. It only kills one thing. There we go. Alright. That's it. Ledros. There. See, I think I'd I'd rather play two Thresh than two Rekindler. I could definitely see just playing like we've almost always played this deck with two Thresh before. You can, 
you can play two thresh. I'd rather do I'd rather have the rekindlers because karma is so vital. Um I'd rather keep the rekindlers. Like seven mana karma is is absolutely worth it. Um Yeah, and Re Rekindler with, with Thresh is awesome, too. So, <clears throat> All right, uh, that's that's Karma Thresh Control, though. Uh, fun last game, even though, you know, like it, you know I uh, lost an unlosable game. <laughs> but that was, that was, uh, that was fun. Uh, fun deck to play, too. All right, those of y'all watching on YouTube, hit that like button over there. Let me know what you think of Ledros, if you think the deck needs Ledros, and if so, like what you would take out and why. Um, you know, leave that comment. I'm thinking maybe Vengeance as the card to take out. Um, but anyway, thank you so much for watching some Karma Thresh Control, and I'll see you for the next video.